Video games are at their most enjoyable when they run smoothly, right? <laughs> no? They're at their best when they shit the bed and stuff like this happens. A glitch in a video game? No. Not the 2015 Australian TV drama of the same name, in case you were confused, is a break in the game's boundaries or systems that often results in some just wacky, goofy shit that'll make you giggle your little pants off. A little baby boy. Video games always have several different systems operating in them, whether it be a fancy-ass physics engine or just a really, really fucking bad partner AI system. Holy, holy shit, Tails, what are you on? These systems make up the game, as even the controller you hold in your swell little cheeseled up mitts is considered a system. In my completely correct opinion, glitches are at their best in futuristic 3D games, because those games have to deal with the most complex systems, and the more complex a system, the more likely for there to be holes in the system, which then gives rise to game owies. I'd like to preface this by saying that some games are just too broken, like Fallout 76, because even though it's just riddled with glitches, it's not that fun because those glitches get in the way of the gameplay, which kind of just ruins the game for you because you can't actually experience it because it's so broken. Different kinds of glitches can bring different kinds of funs, which is why I've placed these glitches into three different categories. Intentional gameplay glitches, unintentional gameplay glitches, and non-gameplay glitches. Let's start with intentional glitches. Intentional glitches are unintended by the developer, but once discovered, they are used by baby gamers to break the game. Much like how I'm gonna break this plate just for the bit. Uh, hi guys, I'm Leo's identical twin, uh, uh, Jeremiah, and I edit the videos. And just letting you know that neither Leo or I would ever destroy a plate. We don't believe in the destruction of property. Uh, just, just wanted to make sure that you guys understand that we wouldn't break a plate. A game like Halo 2 perfectly embodies intentional glitches. While the game is technically sound, that wasn't going to stop diehard gamers from exploiting the ever-living fuck out of the game and discovering shit like sword flying and super bouncing, which have become staples in the landscape of game glitches. Some more prominent intentional glitches are the fly, the flying horsey in Skyrim, where the where the horsey flew. I think I think that one's pretty self-explanatory. The black hole glitch in Super Smash Bros. Melee, where you can experience what has just got to be one of the most satisfying sounds ever. Also, just how when Jigglypuff's shield breaks, she just fucking flies off into the top of the stage and dies. I know it's not a glitch, but it's <laughs> pretty fucking funny. The GTA 4 swing set glitch, where your car would turn into an aeroplane simply if you touched a swing set? What hidden power does this swing set possess? It cannot think, yet it can destroy. The swing set is all-seeing, all-powerful, a force of pure unbridled destruction that cannot be tamed and will taunt us to our dying days. A symbol of the negative effects of extreme industrialization representing man's greed for more and more power. Optimistic nihilism. Melancholic regression. The GTA 4 swing set is... It, it's God. You could make a religion out of that. These intentional glitches allow baby gamers like you and I to just have a little bit of extra fun with the game, whether it be soaring through the skies or just fucking dying. While intentional Whoa. gameplay glitches are hilarious, Unintentional glitches are home to some of the funniest shit I think has ever graced God's green earth. Playing NBA 2K and watching Michael Jordan make history by morphing his hand through the back of the fucking backboard and getting two points is downright beautiful, and it's something that I'm so glad I got to witness. Also when the players shoot backwards, or they teleport across the court, or their, or their limbs grow spaghetti, they're pretty funny as well. Watching carriages bounce up and down in Red Dead Redemption and then just shoot off into the stratosphere with the horse becoming a bit of an unfortunate spaceman is so absurd you almost can't not laugh at it. Same thing goes when your GoldenEye cartridge leans a little bit to the left and all the enemies decide to go, Oh no, I'm the inside of a washing machine now. I'm gonna spin around. Woohoo! Also, also Goat Simulator? Like, like all of Goat Simulator, all of the game. But, without a doubt, the most prolific game, full of unintentional glitches, has to be Skate 3. Just kidding, this shit is way too goofy for that song. 
Skate 3 holds some of my best gaming memories, whether it be playing the game myself or watching PewDiePie series on it, which to me as a little 10 year old doo doo brain was <laughs> the absolute peak of comedy. I had a bit of trouble deciding whether to put this in the unintentional or intentional category, but I felt it suited unintentional best because most would have experienced some unintentional glitch while playing the game, as opposed to actually trying to get one to happen. But enough chit chat, I'm not your year 7 maths teacher Mrs. Jacobs, who wouldn't shut up about a trip to Asia. Yeah we get it Mrs. Jacobs, you flew on a plane to another country, now can we go to lunch or not? Let's get to the glitches. Walking up to certain railings in the games could sometimes mean you got sucked through them, like a little boy drinking milk through one of those, one of those straws with, uh, with full, like with balls in them. And their balls were flavored, like yeah, mint and chocolate and strawberry and shit. The the cow the the cow straws. I can't remember the name. You could hit people with your skateboard and every now and again you just go absolutely fucking flying or be impaled by your skateboard and you turn into a yummy skater skewer. Yummy! You could also glitch through the bottom of the map and when in the right position you could just go absolutely flying to the highest point of the skybox. All these breaks in the game's physics and collision systems created an easily exploitable and slightly broken game which resulted in the perfect amount of wacky zany goofy glitches, but also the perfect amount of some solid right stick dick flip gameplay. While some of the funniest shit I think I've ever seen comes from gameplay heavy glitches, there's also plenty of non-gameplay glitches which house that same amount of entertainment. One of my personal favourite non-gameplay glitches is... <coughs> SEAN! Having an intense, scary, shit your pants scene overridden by the constant repetition of the same few voice lines is absolute comedy gold. I can't even make jokes on it at this point, it's just, it's so much funnier than anything else I could say. Another notable non-gameplay glitch is the fuck it, eyes and mouth only glitch from oh. Assassin's Creed Unity. This glitch shows the main dude with only eyes and a mouth, which is pretty high up there on the holy shit get that away from me or wet myself scale, but the more you look at it, the funnier it becomes. Still gonna, still gonna pee my pants, but, but that's by choice. I'm, I'm not scared. That's, I'm doing that by choice. Also, spaghetti arms. So good, it gets a double mention. All these glitches have had a huge impact on the gaming landscape, with glitches like anything from Skate Three or Missing No from Pokemon spawning thousands of memes and internet inside jokes. These have all had a huge bonding effect on the gaming community allowing baby gamers like you and myself to comment on posts about glitches with hey that was a pretty sick glitch i'm gonna try it out next time i play glitches have also shaped how i enjoy and interact with games and i'll never forget the countless hilarious moments i've had alone and with others thanks to somebody else's mistakes this is a sentiment that i'm sure extends to a lot of you baby gamers watching and if it doesn't then the fuck man how is this not funny <laughs> Well, I'm sure you've gathered that I love glitches, but you know what I love more? You subscribing. And my cat. My cat is here, so you should subscribe, because my because my cat is here. Ow! Ow, you clawed me! You little demon. Uh, no, 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 I just want to make you go funny face. Whee! Happy kitty! Speak. Meow! Meow! Close enough. Not everybody.